What up guys, it's uh, Ayla here and I'm gonna show you quickly how to upload a reference into Nomad. So you might want a reference image if you're sculpting um, to uh, help you come up with what you're gonna make. So you um, can go up to the top left and you see a bunch of icons. We're going for that one that looks like a little picture of mountains there. Um, once you select that, you've got an empty selection here uh, but if you click on that reference image box um, your image will come up you probably don't have one yet so if you click inside that picture box there it might be blank for you um, it'll have all your past references but if you haven't referenced anything yet you're gonna want to import it from your photos so you can bring it in um, say I wanted to do that I don't know I probably wouldn't sculpt uh, an environment like that, but it'll bring it right in. So once you have your reference image selected, you can uh, resize it and stuff. I'm going to go back in and bring in just an illustration because it, it's uh, this is actually something I've sculpted earlier. So um, if you go back to your uh, little reference image box, you can change the position of your image. You can change the scale, which is super helpful. Um, position in the Y, position in the X, back and forth. Uh, maybe I just want to see that much of it while I work, uh, which is really cool. Or I can bring it right back into the uh, center here. And if you change the overlay, that allows you to see your image through your uh, material. Um, so, or it like overlays it on top of your material. So you can really sculpt accordingly and I always sculpt like this uh, in the beginning before I start refining things for my characters at least uh, just to get the proportions right so this is super helpful and if you find that your overlay you're seeing you're not seeing enough or you're seeing too much you can change that and uh, it's really cool so that's it that's how you reference an image into Nomad um, thanks for checking it out with me you guys and I'll see you in my next vid